Hey guys, this is going to be a quick unboxing and review of the Victrola Flip Clock, the large variant. I decided to create this video because I was on the market for a cool flip clock, and oddly, I couldn't find a single YouTube video or review for this product. So I thought I would go ahead and create one so you would know what to expect if you bought one. So let's get into it. To begin with, the reason I picked this Victrola was because I have always been fascinated by the look of flip clocks and wanted one sitting on my shelf. My requirements were simple, it had to be a brick clock, have a silver or chrome look, and most importantly, be affordable. All the other flip clocks I googled were for expensive brands. And there's no way I was spending hundreds of dollars on a clock. But, luckily, with a bit more Amazon digging, I found the Victrola Large Flip Clock for the very affordable price of about 45 American dollars. What a bargain. Here's the packaging. Pretty standard. Clean. Nothing too amazing, nothing too ugly either. Looked pretty good to me. Going ahead and opening the box, you can see it's packed in there pretty snug. And apart from the packaging, you just get a manual, which I won't bother paging through. Here's the front of the clock. And as you can see it's got a great, chrome metal look, which I love. The clock is available in two sizes, a small and a large. This is the large size. Nice big size on those numbers. And it definitely looks like a conversation piece. I love the look. The Victrola logo also doesn't detract from the overall minimalist appeal of the front. Looking behind it, you can see there's not too much to confuse either. You've got a little notice label. A dial to adjust the time. Please note, this dial can only be moved in the upward direction. Rotating it downwards could damage the clock. And there's a slot for batteries. This large size of the clock takes 2D batteries. As for my brief review of the clock, I have to say that I love it so far. It's exactly what I was looking for when I was shopping for a flip clock like this. It's got a sleek, minimalist look. It looks fantastic on my shelf, and I can see it matching a room with pretty much any decor, and it's quiet. Now, obviously, when you buy a flip clock, part of the appeal is the flipping of the numbers. So you can't expect it to be 100% silent like a digital clock. But in a quiet room, apart from the very subtle whoosh of the numbers flipping every minute, there's no real discernible sound. In fact, here you go. I'll turn off the music now, and be quiet, and just hold my phone up to the clock so you can hear what it sounds like in a typical city apartment. See? Pretty quiet to me. So in summary, if you're looking for a flip clock that looks great, works great, and won't break the bank, I think this is a pretty good buy. Thanks for watching.